The first here tonight at 6 in southeast Ohio, more than 2,000 residents are in the process of having their veteran service turned off so crews can repair the gas lines. The main area affected is between Linden and Wayne Avenues. And 2 News reporter Ethan Fitzgerald continues our coverage live with the latest on those repairs. Yeah, Mark, I'm in the Linden Heights neighborhood, and people that have been driving off Linden Avenue has almost surely seen some contractors out here throughout the day. In fact, let's take a look. You can actually see them kind of strategizing right now. We've seen more and more contractors and, and uh, veteran people coming in kind of by the hour, and that will likely be the case through the weekend. As of 1 p.m. Thursday, Vectran and their contractors have shut off gas meters for 500 customers. As temperatures dropped, the sudden outage cut customers by surprise. My heat tried to kick on and it didn't start blowing. And then my neighbor came and knocked on my door and asked me if I had heat. And I said, oh no, not again. Vectran needs to shut off more than 2,000 connections as soon as possible if people want the problem fixed. The issue stems from ongoing gas line work that resulted in the need to purge the system of gas. Vectran said in a statement, we appreciate the patience and understanding of customers and sincerely apologize for this inconvenience, end quote. A Vectran spokesperson told me over the phone that a few hundred workers will come in and help with the shutoff process. Customers like Paul Dose have heat for now and appreciate the hustle by Vectran crews. But the workers would come to the door very professional, uh, to keep us, um, you know, informed about what was going on, what they were doing, when they were going to do it. As crews go door to door, shutting down each home's heat, others are digging holes, prepping for work that could extend into the weekend. You may even get a visit from Vectran as late as midnight. I hear the door, I answer the door, the lady tells me, Hi, I'm from Vectran, I'm sorry if I woke you up. I said, It's okay, I expected you. <laughs> Vectran hopes to have the system clear of old gas by Friday. The goal is to relight the system by late Friday night. And Mark, I just got an update from Vectran just moments ago. They're now up to about 900 houses that have had the heat turned off. They're aiming for 2,000. They have a lot of doors to get to, so you can expect them going door to door throughout the night. Uh, Vectran is also putting people in hotels on a case by case basis. We'll be sure to update you as soon as we learn more on air online, WDTN.com. Ethan Fitzgerald, 2 News, working for you.